Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. It is a beautiful area right on the border with Canada. It is almost three and a half hours drive from Lansing, Michigan where we live. So we had to stop multiple times before we get there. Our first destination is going to be Mackinac City. This is a small town. It is famous for its fresh uh, seafood and desserts and it connects the Michigan mainland with the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. We are in Mackinac City. It's a small town, almost like a village, but it's beautiful. There are some people here, uh, not a whole lot, but uh, it has a very pleasant and relaxing ambience, I would say. There are some eating places, some uh, ice cream places, uh, there's a live performance going on as well, there's this water fountain and uh, a lot of relaxing time for the families. We are back on the road now. In Mackinac City, we ordered our lunch. We had some white fish and fries and shrimp, and they tasted really fresh. Right now, we are crossing Mackinac Bridge. It is a suspension bridge which connects the upper and lower peninsulas of Michigan. It is quite a famous landmark of the state of Michigan. Now we are heading towards St. Ignace. We will be staying here for two days. We will use it as a base to go to Munising and the next day we are going, planning to go to Makino Island. Our hotel in St. Ignace was right on the waterfront and my daughter just wanted to go straight in. Even the next day when she woke up, she was so excited to see the seagulls and water and uh, she spent a lot of time just standing there and talking to them. Now we have left St. Ignace and we are going towards Munising. The main attraction of that city are the picture rocks. Those are beautiful rocks that have patterns and colors due to different quantities of minerals in there. That area also contains a number of small waterfalls and hiking trails that lead to those falls. Our first stop was Miner's Trail that leads to Miner's Waterfall. The trail is not very long, it is only 15 to 20 minutes walk, so it is comfortable as well as safe for kids and elderly. Now we are going to see pictured rocks, but once we got to the dock to take the cruise, we found out that cruises are being cancelled due to bad weather. There were high wind speeds of around 25 miles an hour and very high water waves in the lake, around 7 to 10 feet high. So we decided to explore other waterfalls in the area. I'm here at Munising Falls in Munising. It's a beautiful place. You see the falls in the background and the trail to get to these falls is a short walk. It's like 800 feet only and it's a paved trail as well. So good for uh, strollers, for uh, wheelchairs, so it's very accessible. Now we are at Sandpoint Beach, which is surprisingly one of very few sandy beaches in this area. Most of them are rocky or have cliffs around them. To 
Today we have woke up early to see this spectacular view of sunrise. Our plan for today is to go see the Mackinac Island, which is one of the most famous summer destinations in the USA. It was a nice sunny day and we took a ferry to get to the island. In Mackinac Island, there are a lot of shops that are famous for their desserts. Especially their fudge is very good. Other than the shops, there are horses and carriages and bicycles that you can rent out to take a round trip of the island. That's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel to stay connected.